well, this really does feel like a privilege. We're about half an hour uh, out to sea in this speedboat off the Pakistani city of Gwadar. And as you can see through the mist, this brand new island has now emerged. And it is much bigger than I thought it was, even having read about it. And just extraordinary to think, looking at it, that it simply didn't exist a few days ago before that earthquake. Well, here we are, and while all that awful devastation is going on hundreds of miles away after that earthquake, here is something really quite fascinating. Until a few days ago, this was all part of the seabed here, and you can see all around here coral and detritus and rock that was all there, and dead animals as well, so fascinating. But as you can also see, it's attracted people uh, who've been coming here in their boats to come and have a look at this uh, new extraordinary curiosity. A bad side of that though is that already within a few days there's already rubbish here, cigarette packets and papers and biscuit packets and scientists are saying that this area needs to be protected because it is such a unique environment to study. But for those people who do want to see this place they're going to have to be very quick indeed because according to scientists with previous experience they say that islands like this could disappear within a year.